well, uh, you know, the government uh, tries to buy public, uh, we say various goods and services through public procurement. Every year, government is buying uh, goods and services worth 34 lakh crore through public procurement by various state government, public sector banks and uh, CPSCs. Uh, till now, this whole process was uh, through our normal paper process where the tenders were published in the newspapers or, you know, in various uh, platforms. Now, in 2016, government decided that we should take advantage of the digital transformation which is taking part in the country and uh, we should digitize the whole procurement process. So, from August 2016, uh, Prime, Minister, Prime Minister Mr. Modi, he initiated a process wherein government e-marketplace was made. It's an e-platform like Amazon Flipkart, wherein now government buyers can procure everything through e-platform and there is no need of any paper tenders or file movement between various departments or the payment by checks and everything. This whole process is now cashless, paperless and contactless where now sellers get access to all the government uh, buyers needs sitting across in various uh, parts of the country and they can participate in different uh, tenders of different departments and now they have got access to market all over India. So that is the initiative which has been taken by government and because of the initiative, this initiative, government has been able to save now 10% of its cost. So like till now GEM, that is government e-marketplace, has generated GMB gross merchandise value of 6 lakh crore for government and it has saved 60,000 crores for the government. So that is a big amount which is quantifiable, which has happened because of digital transformation in our eagerness. Well, our IT policy has allowed that all the procurement which is happening through government e-marketplace, that is totally transparent. The IT cyber security issues are being looked after. We are, our platform is STQC qualified. And uh, Touchwood, uh, we have not been uh, hacked till now in last seven years since inception. Rather, uh, you know, we gave an open challenge to the good hackers that in case you can hack our system and open the financial bid before the technical bid, we'll give you 10 lakh rupees. And uh, till now, nobody has been able to hack our system. So we are following the government's IT security in uh, true spirit. And uh, we are giving uh, good competition to all the other e-platforms uh, in the private sector also. We have been able to generate uh, uh, GMB of 25 billion dollars, which is much more than Amazon or Flipkart, which is in India. So, though you said there are no threats, but I still think there were challenges. Challenges are there, but we have got we have got uh, you know various measures which we have taken, like STQC qualified as we are certified are there. Cyber security measures have been taken. There is a proper. Uh, technical team which looks after the cyber security issues. We have, you know, requested the private hackers to hack our system and see how what all they've been able to hack. And then we have filled in the gaps in the system.